Hello friends, welcome back to e-commerce project in Laravel. Last video I will show you how to make a front side like a menu. Like here we did like a menu inside shop after you can hover so you can see it. Like what is the electronic inside item, what is the fashion inside item. Like a subcategory and category we did here. So in this video we can continue like a menu we can means the category subcategory we can show. But inside mobile because here is a two type work. Suppose I am going to mobile. So you can see it here like uh, homes inside shops inside like products like this menu there. So how we can do here we need to work here like simple way we need to show here is a category name and inside we need to show subcategory name. So also here need to show category name and inside we need to show subcategory name. So we need to do here like this. So I can explain how it's possible. Okay. So open your project and you can open your like a project and open your codes. And I want to request you are new in this channel otherwise in this series. So please subscribe and please press the bell icon. So you always get a notification and you can learn something every day new. This is the reason otherwise no any reasons. Just need to go to resources inside you need to go views inside you can see it like layout and inside we have did like mobile menu. Suppose you are following this series so you can easily understand like mobile menu. So we don't want to need like a inside home like all thing just remove. Okay. Like a home inside there just I remove and let's make a bigger for you okay and just go back again and we can put here our url like a whatever url we are using this one simple way just you can put like this url okay after we need to do like a category subcategory so we need to get data using the database here after is possible here so first we need to get the data but let's see how it's work on the home okay just go back again, refresh the page so we can check this home is how it works. Just click here. So home is like professional. Now it's saying same like linking. You can see it here. Now we need to make like a sub menu means like a category and inside you need to show sub category. I know here you can click on the so you can work, but we need to put here. Suppose you can click here. So working very well. No issue. Okay. So let's back back code. It is a very simple because we have already done inside a like a desktop side how we can do just go to header files and you can see it here we are getting the data suppose you are see like a old video so you can easily understand suppose you are not watch old video so i will provide inside description link so just you can go inside and you can down means you can watch the video so you can easily understand how we can make desktop inside menu just copy this line and go to mobile menu otherwise you don't want to copy so we need to just go to app inside so first we are showing the header so always find out this variable like whatever we are working inside a header.blade.php you can see it here so this is like first you can go to app blade php so you can see it include is first after content after footer our mobile menu is a down so let's try this one work not work so just copy this for each loop okay i need to go and you can put here and after you can close like a and for each Okay, once you can save and just go back and we can check is working, not working. Okay, refresh the page. So it is not working, 100% generate the error. So we can copy again to mobile ones. So you can see it here is undefined variable get category header. So what we need to do, go to back again header one and just copy this PHP code and you can paste here. Okay. After I can show you the query how we can made. Okay. So don't worry about that. And here we can change like a header to mobile. And also I can change here like a get category to mobiles. Now go to category models. Suppose you need to go app. Inside you can see it like model. Inside you can see it like category models. And here you can see it like a get record menu. So this is the query we did here category dot star so category database inside whatever there we can get here means table inside and after we have made some join query and after we are checking like a status like a is not deleted also status is active this one we have already set here okay so just go to here and we can change the name so here we can get the data you can see it because we are not creating new function whatever desktop side working this function here working okay i just save and also you can see it Let's go back again, refresh the page so we can check is working, not working. Okay. So it's very simple. Just go back and refresh the page. So you can see it now error is not showing. 
just click on the link so you can see like all the category showing like here like main category sub category like all thing is showing here so let's change the name so we can easily understand how it's look show okay so just go back again and we can change this variable like adder to mc okay mobile category and just we can change here like a name after you can save these files and you can go back and you can see it here so you can see it mobile category name here also okay so just go so you can see electronics fashions like uh, shops home furnitures beauty so you can see it okay now we need to show here our sub category so first we need to show sub category let's change our url so whatever database inside our slug we have did like admin side this slug we need to pass here suppose i can open my admin okay e-commerce admin slash dashboard i hope work otherwise into login okay is 100 percent into logins admin at the rate gmail.com and password is one two three four five six everybody using same login i know about that and just go to category so you can here showing like a slug so our database column name also is a slug let's open the database so i can show you okay let's use once database open after i can show but let me do here like a slug so here I, what i can do like a url same thing we have did inside desktop suppose you can see it here like header so you can see it here slug so just copy same thing so it's also possible and you can put here okay and, and you can change here variable name like a mobile category value mobile category and i just go back again and refresh the page so also you can see it here and here our database like e-commerce and e-commerce inside you can see it like a category so category inside you can see it like a slugs whatever do you want to see you can see it you can see slugs there meta title also there this is the how we can use i can explain so don't worry about that and here is a electronics name so means uh, this is the name like uh, this name suppose i click here so you can see it like electronics is going to electronics because he's a slug is a electronics suppose i click on the fashion so also going to fashion but this is the page we have not created just set up here like a category inside headers okay so don't worry now we can go back again and we we need to run here our subcategory so we have already used inside a get subcategory you can see this function and header inside i already show you how we can do it so just copy for this line uh, sorry not line this line and put inside mobile inside like starting here to here you can make like a and for each now we don't need any other here so just remove okay so here we can change but first we need to change like mobile categories like value m means mobile and c means category and inside a get sub category because we have already made a relationship inside a category inside you can see it as many as many means is a sub category model inside so but this is the category id is available yes it's available so we need to make join and like okay this is the category you need to provide him and also we have made like here is the status is active and is not deleted this is the thing we have made a where query okay so let's go back again and we need to write our code so what we do here is a ads means mobile subcategory okay and here i can do it like a name i'm always doing like a unique name because i don't want to generate the issue otherwise you can do like a same name is work but future sometimes generate the issue is better we can do is like unique name means a variable name okay i save these files i just go back again refresh the page and i just go to mola means i click on so you can see it so i can open the here is a new tab mobile view so better you can understand you can see shop inside you can see it like a electronics like this there you see so it's working very well and after i will explain suppose we have no subcategory so we don't want to show this one i will explain also so don't worry in this video okay mm -hmm. so what we can do so suppose you have no subcategory for this book and movies toys and games sport so we don't want to show this menu so we need to make some condition and i will show you how we can do it so in this video also i will cover so here you can see it like all subcategory you see so let's remove like product page blog events we don't need to so just go down and we can clear all thing and after we can provide like a subcategory url 
okay so just we can remove this one and we can provide here url so it's very simple same is a subcategory inside also slug there and same thing is a like a category inside also slug there so first we need to show category because i need to make a proper seo this reasons and after slash here because i have concat both slug and here is a also slug there so i just make it like this slugs okay so it is done it's very simple we done okay i just go back again refresh the page and i can click on the menu and after i click on the electronics after i can click on the smart what let's click on the laptops and computers i click here so you can see it first is a sub main category our main category after you can see it like a sub category slug suppose you can go to database like a sub category tables so you can see it here like a category id 1 so one inside what's there smart you can see laptop and shopping means computer you can see it like a here also there shopping but this is the shopping why is not showing because he is a deleted you can see delete is equal to 1 this reason is shopping not showing here like i think you can understand why is not showing shopping is first because of he is a deleted you can see it but is a category id is a 1 okay now main thing you need to learn here suppose right now so you can see it here is a fashion inside there so it's showing okay now furniture inside there showing like a beauty and personal care inside there showing but book and movies inside not there sub category why we need to show because here is no any products so we don't want to show this menu so just we need to make a one conditions like first we need to check like a here a category like just making tab okay if value mc means this is the variable and inside the sub category count is not empty so going to inside otherwise empty so we don't want to go inside okay i save this files and i just go back again and we can refresh the page so you can see it here showing not showing so you can say like only for category showing because the for category inside product there so i can go to front end and i just over so you can see it electronic fashion home and furniture and beauty and personal care inside you can see it sub category other is a like three or four category main category there inside personal product means sub category is not there so here is a mobile menu he is not showing you can see it here so it's very simple just need to make like this condition you need to make count okay sub category is available so we need to work here otherwise we don't want to work here okay once you can add admin side like a sub category so you can see it here okay automatically because we have made a condition this reason same thing we can short out inside a header file because is a like a is good because we don't want to work like a like a wrong way we can work like a professional way this reasons and i need to explain very well so just we can do here also condition it's very simple and here you can make like a and if and after we need to change the variable name like here is a header category so just here you can change the variable name and you can put like this okay so let's go back inside like a desktop view and we can check is working not working so you can see it now other category not showing suppose you can go to admin side and you can add like inside a jewelry so let's make a jewelry inside whatever do you want to like you can add a category i just give the example okay like i can go to like a jewelry and watches i just put like a jewelry is only okay i don't know because i have find out inside google otherwise ai tools i can i am using and doing so active and also i can make here jewelry okay and i just click on the submit buttons so sub category is add successfully you can see it inside jewelry and watches inside jewelry and i go to refresh the page so you can see it here also showing the jewelry and watches inside jewelry menu i will click on so is a also work url jewelry watches inside jewelry whatever slug you are did here okay same thing you can go to mobile you and you can refresh so also you can see it here like a jewelry and watches and you can see it here okay now sometime you think okay i need to make it like this like a, this is the category sub category inside shop okay like electronic after fashion i need to show first fashion i don't want to show like electronic first but you already done inside database so how you can do it 
is a lots of people generate like this issue and generate the problem okay this is the like our main branches is like a show patient we need to show first and after we need to show electronics so what we need to do so it is a very simple just category inside we can do like order by so this is the order by like we need to add another column here order by so one you can add so we can make order by is a like a i device so you can do it but i will explain next video in this video just i will cover like a mobile category and how we can add without sub category I means suppose you have no sub category so we don't want to show here this is the i will explain inside a, in this means inside means in this video and next video we can make like a, how to change position like a drag and drop wise also possible and also possible is a like a order by but we can do it a drag and by suppose you can drag and you can go up and you can drag down so you can go down it is a good and you can learn something new inside a table you because order by the so what we need to just we need to add a new columns and we can do it easily so let's use here drag and drop so you can use it like the same is that we have did inside product suppose you can go to products and you can add it for this like any products suppose we have add some here pictures i think first ones fourth ones yes like this you can see it so same thing we can move like category but this is the i can show you inside table view okay so you can see it like this very simple is not difficulty so you can understand it easily okay and i hope you can understand for this video what i explain and do you want to like this video so please like and do you want to see like this video more so please subscribe our channel and thank you for watching